HitFirstBoxing.com, we in the house. Hola Falabi, first things first, congratulations. I mean, you, you know, we're not gonna lie, man. The opponent, it was someone, but yeah. the real opponent was supposed to be Mr. Pavel Kowalczy. Yes. Speak on Mr. Pavel Kowalczy, yeah. what a, happened? He's a punk, you know? Like, he signed to fight me in his hometown, like in June. We postponed the fight three weeks to fight in New York. He wouldn't sign. The only thing that changed from June to July was the location. Yeah. A lot of these guys want to fight in their hometown and get hometown decisions and stuff. I don't care. I'll go to his hometown and fight him, but this just made more sense for the promotion. Of course, so, HBO. Yeah, so he didn't want to come Martin. down. He didn't want to fight, so screw it. We went down the list from IBF rank number one to number 11. Nobody said yes, yeah. so I give all respect to this guy. He stepped yes. up. He took I don't it. care what his record is. He had a decent record, but I faced better opponents. But he still showed the heart to come and fight. Because I know Ola, I seen an interview in 2010 where Mr. Pavel Kowalji said, I'm ready for Marcus Huck, Ola Falabi, I want them all. Yeah. Four years later, yeah. Listen, we offered to fight him in 2012 also. He said yes. Then uh, apparently he got in a car accident, his back was hurting. He just doesn't want to fight, man. He doesn't, they don't want dangerous fights. They want to keep their zeros. We all know the cruiserweight division is in a situation where it's not in a good situation, man. I mean, you know, you're a man that's doing your thing in the cruiserweight division. I mean, you got Diablo Voldapchik out there, man. Would you want to step in the ring with Diablo or, I mean, who's listen, on your list? Who's on your radar? Who do you want? Listen, I'm 34 years old, bro. Yeah. Okay, anybody they tell me to fight, I fight. I don't care, you know. The money's there, the money's not there. It's, if the money's not there and I'm going up and ranking, I'll take it. If the money's there, I'll take it. There's no reason for me not to fight now. You know, I'm not 27 anymore. I'm not 24. I can't say, hell. Oh, I'll wait for the next fight for this guy. Whoever they call, we're going to go get him. Maybe move this, up and wait? Now I'm mandatory for the IBF after this fight. So we're going to jump and fight Hernandez. Beautiful. So after Hernandez, maybe what? Move up and wait? Heavyweight division now? No, I'm going to stay cruiserweight. You stay cruiserweight. Yeah, those guys are too big. Look at look at that one. That's a heavyweight right there. I have to fight him. <laughs> Hola, a couple last words for your fans worldwide, big man. A couple last words for your fans. I love you. Support me. I'm a humble guy. Just coming up. Hard work, man. Always a pleasure, man. Thank you. Keep Thank up you. the hard work, man. Thank you.